right and welcome back for you no time has passed for me quite a bit uh, which is the life of a non full-time streamer sometimes you're getting called away mid mission so where have we stopped i think we just were trying to get that bridge which was uh so far right. quite nice mission and i uh -huh. know that these guys wanted to attack us and i had reserved special frag grenade for them Nades are good. There is no way around it. Moving up. Oh, come on, Diaz. I was about to say, you will be able to finish that one guy, right? Going now. Good. We're nicely moving up. Affirmative. I'm wondering if that big Ready boss not, is just going to come in and stomp the living hell out of us with us uh, without us even having a chance to react. That would be somewhat some disappointing. Good. So far, I'm doing, yeah, according to my own uh, standards, reasonably well, I would say, on insane difficulty. Potentially, you can play that much better, but Go ahead. it was okay so far. So yeah, it would be really disheartening if, let's say, that big thing comes in and just one-shots us. Good to go. All right, reloading. We are reloaded here, so can We're might as well overwatch. Over line, people. Gotta get the show rolling. Welcome. Good. Let's set up a parameter here for now. There, a vantage point. Let's group up there and plan our next move. Sounds like someone wants to meet us. Oh boy, is that? Is uh, that the enemy that I'm thinking it is? Good, we're moving down. The boss is near. I like the foreshadowing. Sweet. Stay out of trouble, Jack. Good. Overwatching. Overwatching. Yes. And overwatching, and the sniper here has a nice little view. Unfortunately, can only overwatch kind of through that sure little then. corridor here. It's better than nothing, I suppose. I see you. I wonder if these guys come in waves so that they are just spawning and we just gotta move if I'm moving too slow. Let's make this count. Okay. Yeah, Report. let's make this count. I I fully agree. Heavy on standby. I'm here. Our uh, grenades are unfortunately Ready. all, and I mean all, on cooldown. Sniper needs its uh, aura. Oh, you won, Jack. Great job, Jack. Confirming Jack's aura for next turn, but we also want Stay to become trouble, invisible. Jack. Eyes peeled. Overwatch. I said Overwatch. On standby. And Overwatch. All oh yeah, almost forgot. 81%? Well, I think we can give it a go. 100% crit chance, that might be a kill. I've got nothing. Okay, well, Reloading here. almost. Almost a kill. What? 
and missed the 81% shot. Good, so the wretches are not a problem. The Hammer 4 drones are also not so much. I think we can outrange them. As long as the enemy doesn't have one of the heavier units, I, I think we can do reasonably well. Uh, speaking about heavier units, uh, that I think is a drone, a sniper drone, right? Yeah, sniper drone. Yeah, we gotta kill that guy. Yep. Okay, so apparently for whatever reason, if we're moving to here, that is line of sight. Here. Time to up your game. Good. I'm moving up. Right up here. Stacking those little auras. Checking you up. And Thanks for the assist, Jack. Then Later, becoming Jack. invisible ourselves. Why exactly are we yep. not be why why exactly can't we see this guy? It just indicated we could see him. Look at that, there is that white line. Are you telling me when I'm moving here, I just can't see him? How's that hit indicator going to work if if uh, I can't see him there? Heavy reporting in. Okay, I don't understand it yet. Uh, yeah. That's quite unfortunate, to be honest. Reducing the damage by a taunt. Extraction level two, right there. We're covered over here. Last round. Come on, let's kill him. There we go. Bagged and tagged. Reloading. Reloading. And a nice little Overwatch. On Overwatch. Not the cleanest turn. I don't know how to get to this guy here. I thought I've seen line of sight, but apparently I was wrong. I see him. Gotta reload. <laughs> I'm okay. Wow, what? Let's mess them up. This guy here is dangerous. Hey. All right, we gotta, we gotta deal with these guys, and we gotta deal with them now. Okay, so two snipers. How do we want to deal with that? And we got one guy in Overwatch. Yep. I mean, we could Ideas? storm in, but I think that would be a bit unwise against the What's snipers. Next? It seems we don't have a time limit here. So I'm wondering if we're just for now. Scanning now. Going to Overwatch.
Good, we can't take actions this turn. If we're hunkering down. Uh, too close for comfort. Deploying that protection zone. Great job, Jack. Moving up, and then we're just going to hunker down. We're using the time to reload. Awaiting orders. Reloading. Or reload. And we're hunkering down. In the meantime, reload up here. And a nice little overwatch. That way, if someone actually comes into that direction, should be able to kill him. So he has 75% badass reduction, 40% from the uh, zone, and 40% from hunkering down. He should take no damage whatsoever. What is that? Uh, sniper drone, okay. One, two, Thanks for the assist, Jack. and three. We're out of line of sight, so there is no problem. That's one hit. That is another hit and fast finger reload. Plus we are overwatching, okay. I got overwatch. Yes. En route. Moving nicely into the damage reduction Got zone. My eyes peeled. Go ahead. I don't know, shall I risk it? I mean he has badass and area. and that I'm extra damage that re reduction zone. Blew their shot. You want me, asshole? On my way. One move over here. One move over there. And a nice little charge. Ever gonna let up? Ready. Rub down. Okay, I, I think the sniper is actually doing quite well up there. One, two, three. Let's continue with almost a hundred percent chance to hit. Nah, that's just a 50-50. I'd rather reload. Reloading here. Okay. He has moves up. Missed the target. I don't want to use um, the extra action yet. I think I want to save that. For next turn. I read you. On the move. And we're slowly but surely advancing. 
Setting up the perimeter. Tip upper lip, people! Okay, are those grenadiers? Shit, those are grenadiers. can tell you what we're going to place a mine here and this should work well as well that's a kill and the disturbance And afterwards, we're going for some nice little cover, even though we're the frontliner here. Shit, yeah. <laughs> Sniper moves in. Jake gets all excited with his aura. Moves up here and then hides. Ready. Stay out of trouble, Jack. I'm listening. Moving over. Hmm. I think this here helped quite well against the guys uh, in the previous fights they don't seem to be really good in fighting I'm listening. from afar but equally so we're not really good at hitting I'll not on stop. this distance i'm ready lots of overwatches buckle up people Good, that was a nice little interrupt. Another interrupt. You gotta give uh, the gunner credit. Keeps them plenty busy. Down and out. Go ahead. 33% 20. That's not good enough. And that is way too close. Got Let's it. move to here. Apparently this here is currently <laughs> our zone. Moving in. Overlapping all of the auras. And Jack just goes invisible for now. See you, Jack. So what are we dealing with? 50%. Not great. Okay. Hit the road. I got this area. Okay, so the sniper has one extra shot. I think this here is the best one she will eventually get. And there is a decent crit chance, so might as well do that. Gun going dry. Still 55% uh, chance to crit. I think I rather want I'll her to it. knock them back and interrupt them. All right, reloading. Nah, too low of a hit chance. I rather want the full overwatch. They won't get past me.
that we're tr um, switching sides just in case someone tends to move over here. My eyes peeled. And I'm not sure if that mass overwatch is the right counter for them, but so far with the heavy it worked out well. Okay, clear these last ones out so we can do our recon. Let's see how they like this. Yep. Hundred percent chance to kill him. Should do that. Who's next? What? Thirty percent hit chance. Let's I'm get a bit it. closer. That's much better. Boy, they are tough. Ready. Taking the high ground. Heavy moves over. Jack moves over. I think coordinated reload might be the, the way to go here. What's next? Headed out. Good. Everybody reloads. That's four reloads uh, for one turn. Gotta admit that is a really good ability. Apparently Diaz was the only one not getting the memo. Bring it on, I'm ready. Okay. Hold the line, people. Okay. Hit the road. There's still Targeted one us. guy down there. Let's do this again sometime. Get that last grub. Hammerburst drone. Okay, well we should be able to kill them. What's that? Moving up, heavy moves up as well, and Jack secures our second crate. That's good. Everything's on cooldown, which is not so good. So let's just wait for now. Jack, close. Scanning now. On standby. Okay, at least everybody is reloaded. Reporting in. Thanks to Jack. We're covered here. Brace for attack. Okay, so is this drone here going to come up? Time to get to work. I got this area. Uh huh. Yes, no, maybe. Later, Jack. All right, come Enemy on. Movement. There's a ladder, dude. You can, you can move up. Yep, that's my boy. You're too goddamn dumb to live. <laughs> Gotta admit, Ready it was a game. bit stupid, but I like it. Twenty-five percent crit chance. That's a hit. And that is a kill and a reload. Okay, so we gotta be here, and apparently this here almost looks like the terrain for the boss, I would guess. On it. Moving. Jack moves. Diaz moves and Sid takes the point. Ideas? All right, he's almost toast. On Overwatch. Hostile down. Good. Let's hide. 
Later, Jack. And hope that this is not an, a massive trap. Make it count. Good, reloading and reloading, and we also need the skills back. All right. So far, we're doing surprisingly well. On route. This could have been much, much worse. Orders. Good. Sniper. Sniper needs to move up. Let's see what they got. Killing time. Alright, let's move up the sniper. Is there more room over here? Yep, there is more room. A little bit of crawling. Watch me go. It's quite obvious at this point that we're that we're forced to go down. Uh, go boy, uh, I'm excited. Yep. Oh my gosh! Don't want to I die. <laughs> the boss really looks like someone Next who cloak. could one-shot you. Okay, Time for now, sit. Moves up. Way. It's going to be our tank. Oh, what? We everybody Putting needs in. to move down. Oh. Heavy here. I get the vague feeling that this will not end well. Okay, so now let's see where we're at. Still no sign of him. I think our little friend is getting closer. Ukon. Summon the beast! Crush them! You're saying, dead eye? Get down! <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Multiple attacks already sounds bad, but it is vulnerable from behind. Brumac, let up! Gotta surround them. Rocket incoming! Get out of the strike zone! Okay. The emulsion tanks on his back. We destroy them, he goes down. He's gonna try to shield them, so we need shooters on both sides. These Brumacs get feisty. 
Buckle up, people. All right, one. That would be two. Don't want to out. wait that long. Check. Check moves up here. Gives a nice little aura. Nice work, Jack. And then protects everybody because I have the feeling that this guy is just going to one-shot us elsewise. Forty percent damage reduction. Good, Jack. He's better than nothing. There are moments when you need to get the loot, and there are moments when you certainly do not need to get the loot. Can Diaz get here without trying to get the loot, please? Thank you. On my way. Reporting. All right. Sid is going to be. The tank. And if we're frag grenading it, how's this going to work? Is that going to work at all? I'm not seeing it. Oh, yeah, yes, now I'm seeing damage. The guns have individual hit points. Well, hello there. Of course, we're going to use frag grenade. grenade. Good. We take out his guns, it's one less thing to worry about. Okay. Well, good for us, right? Wrong. Well, this guy is... This guy is quite a thing. Got your back, soldier. Good. The idea is alpha striking. And I'm trying to do my best to do exactly that. Trying to hide his tanks. What? Hit him from the other side. Okay. Well, I should have known about that mechanic a tiny bit beforehand. Down to my last round. She is indeed down to her last round. somehow hit him. No, not with that. Hundred percent hit chance, but uh, as long as it doesn't blow up, there is not much we can do. Oh wow, we're dealing a lot of damage here. We're overwatching as good Are as we you? can. Reloading. Yes, reload. Grenade almost would take it out. Crit chance is too low. Let's go with the grenade. Better than nothing. Frag out. That gun is almost down. Okay, Overwatch doesn't work. Spread out! Don't give him an easy stomping target. Ooh. That would have been a one shot. You get a free shot at those arm cannons? Take it! Oh boy. Shit! Chain gun! Brock 
Okay, so much for not immediately using all of your grenades. Does a monster this nasty really need rockets too? Who does that? The asshole you just went loose cannon on, that's who! Hey, that was a clean kill! How was I supposed to know Ukhan's some kind of super grub? Starting to hit the Got back. The turning. Hey. Heading yeah, out. we gotta put distance between us and it. Okay, one of the guns is down. Weapon destroyed. Should slow him down. But we should shoot first and ask questions later. That's one hit onto his tank. Pretty good hit. Got the Brumac turning. 30% crit chance. We're looking at 800. Not good enough. What is Jack able to do? Thanks, Jack. Yes. Then Jack up. Yes. He's out of range. So might as well make himself invisible. I don't know what's going to come out of here, but it can't be good. Thirty percent crit chance. If we're critting, that would be great. Eliminate another gun. Unfortunately, did not. Move into position. Move further right. away, so that that thing is not just going to continue pounding on us. We could Overwatch completely. That would not be the worst idea. Problem is the healing. Can't really do anything for the other side. The thing that we can do is deal. effectively hitting someone. And he needs to look into our direction. So let's hit him so that he's actually coming over to us. We have removed one of the miniguns. Down and out. And thanks to our attacks, our sniper has healed some of the hit points. Standing by. Okay, let's start again with a sniper. Guns going dry. Hmm. 
pretty solid chance to crit. I would like to continue taking out the guns. Really didn't work out that well. We're being a bit risky here, but Jack still has full life. So we're giving essentially a time unit over by letting her reload. And I'm still trying to, to get that gun down. Okay, both of the guns are down. Hell yeah! Both Brumac guns down! Still have the problem here. Four more turns until the frag grenade, so. Turn the tank. Yeah. We're moving a bit closer. Not too close. First tank destroyed. Keep hammering him. Boy. All right, Diaz here. Yeah. Did rather. I, I think we're just hunkering down. Forty percent evasion, seventy-five percent damage reduction. just stomped him and he fell into the hole and although I survived I sort of did not survive ah it was a good run so far guys and then the rancor just moved over us okay I learned a couple of important lessons that's potentially the price you have to pay if you have never played the encounter before Michaela's next lead looks solid. We're seeing heavy locust activity in the city of Clay. Okay, and welcome back to another uh, try. Uh, this is attempt number two. We just had our first death. Uh, Sid was unfortunately been pushed right into the Rango hole. I'm wondering, although this guy is called Brumok, by the way, I'm going to call it uh, Rango because it looks like the Rango from uh, Star Wars. So I'm wondering uh, how we're going to deal with that. I think last time the tactic had been quite clear. <clears throat> we wanted to destroy the cannons and then eventually start hammering down the tanks. Problem is once those uh, holes are popping up, it's getting quite difficult. Standby. So let's move up Salga. as far as we can for a single time Go unit. Ahead. That's two. That's only one time unit. Appreciate it. We're going to use Jack here. Again, single time unit only. Moving all the way to here. Good. So, Jack. 
Let's take the sniper aura. Yes. Thanks, Jack. And let's also do coordinated assault. Doing good, Jack. We gotta alpha strike this as much as we can. Is it worth running all the way over here? Potentially, as a starter, yes. So, on route. let's move Ready. all the way over there. Sid is going to tank. Copy. And I would really like to give a 20% damage bonus, but for the most potential shots that we could get, which means let's give that to our sniper. Questions, do we want to give it right away or do we wait for one turn and then completely unload next turn? I think we need the cooldown sooner than later. All so right, let's do this. The, the faster we get it on cooldown, the, the faster we'll eventually get it back. So Awaiting that order. logic, uh, with that logic in mind, I'll start hitting the cannon. 630 damage on a crit. Pretty solid chance for a crit. I like what I'm seeing. And Good. there's the critical. We take hit. out his guns, it's one less thing to worry about. But we're continuing with that. Yes. No need to overwatch or anything. Yep. Let's get some extra shots here. We do have two action points and what's our chance of actually critting him uh, it 65% chance and it would be a thousand so I like those odds shit that was good weapon destroyed wow that was really down. good still got a couple of ability points uh, left over Go on ammo. He's trying to hide his tanks. Hit him from the other side. All right, can't really hit him very well from here. The Rango turned around but didn't expose his gun again, which is a shame. Let's think that through. You have a chance to let it turn around yet again. Got the Brumac turning. Okay. There's a chance for a thousand and three points of damage. Let's just. Oh wow, zero uh, zero percent chance for crit with that shot. Okay, well. Go ahead. Um, not sure why exactly, although I didn't move why the target is just gone. That is very strange. Okay, moving up here. We're Time reloading. Reload. Something is wrong with the targeting here. Look at that, we can't really hit the Rancor at all. Neither from the front nor from the back. It's in a weird position. Alright, we're continuing to hit it. Got to take some damage. And if I was to throw a grenade, would that hit the weapon? Oh, come on. Not even a bit. The Rango itself seems quite immune to grenade damage, so... Wouldn't be surprised if this here does exactly nothing.
Okay, we... We do have an action unit left over and I don't want to move anywhere else, so might as well try to hit him with a grenade. We're going out. Drops are on the move. Well, the grenade indeed didn't do anything. Spread All right, out. badass. Don't give him an easy stopping target. There we go, nice little damage reduction. Like it. Shit! You get a free shot at those arm cannons? Take it! Incoming rocket! Okay, we potentially need to move again. Yeah, no surprise. He's targeting us with the rockets. Does a monster this nasty really need rockets too? Who does that? The asshole you just went loose cannon on, that's who! Hey, that was a clean kill! How was I supposed to know Ukhan's some kind of super grub? Good, we're moving over. All ears. <laughs> Jack is following. And so far, I think we can even Jack up. In this case, let's give it to the heavy. If we move over here, we can let it turn, then kill the weapon. In transit. And I think we're relatively speaking safe over here. Good. Wrangler turns. That means the weapon is facing in our direction Heavy for the first time. In. That's a solid hit. Crit. Ready. Fantastic. I love yep. it. Single shot hit. Hell yeah. Good. So Both far, all of the down. weapons are gone. Now it's time to go for the tanks. Got the Brumac turning. Good, we're forcing it to turn again. Very nice, very nice. And can we hit that tank? Something is. Oh, wait. We're out of. Uh, we're out of actions. Yeah, she took two actions. I wanted to use fast fingers in order to get a reload, but that yeah, yeah. is not going to happen. Instead, let's move over here. It's currently <laughs> focusing on us, and let's give ourselves hunker down. That is six, seventy-five percent damage reduction and evasion. I knew that the tanking abilities would be uh, would eventually come in handy. Rockets inbound. And of course, we're being targeted again, and there is the next problem. I mean, look, we could sort of move over here, but that would be a pretty far stretch. Might as well just tangle and dance between both of these locations. There's a nice little remote reload for both of you guys, saving you some actions. 
could have done that once we've emptied all of the clips. So a little bit reckless with the actions here. This here is we're in a bad spot we gotta move even further back and then eventually kill those guys as they come out for now let's hit that rancor I missed. oh wow you missed that's not good copy How many hit points does that thing have? I think I... Not enough. I, that should kill the first tank. Alright. First tank destroyed! Worked like a charm. Keep hammering him! Cool. It does not turn around when you kill the first tank. I could overwatch against these guys, potentially not worth it. Instead, let's focus on those tanks in the background. it over okay so far so good right we're going to overwatch just in case Honor. these guys are going to move out I don't want to turn the rancor again I think we're fine hunker down will take some more time for now might as well wait We're until that first here. pair up of uh, wretches is going to come up. Watch that e -hole. Right, we have to destroy the e-hole. There's no, there are no two ways about it. That might interrupt his Overwatch, to be honest. Yep. Solidly interrupted. Heads up! He's bringing extra firepower! Oh, wow. Okay. Well, Sid definitely needs to get, get away here. Do we have... Ready. Yeah, we do have an extra action. So Sid needs to run as far as he can. Potentially all the way up to here. We're, go uh, we're going to yeah. take care about that hole next turn. Ready. here ah. 
Get after it now. I'm not going to use Sid's grenade, although this would have been kind of the Heavy easy here. choice here, because I will need it next turn to close that other hole. Fire in the hole. Close the hole. Okay, so one down. Quite a few to go. Can we go and take high ground? No, we can't. Three. I think this here is potentially the best position we could take. 70% chance to hit. All of our assaults are on cooldown, so barrier would be great over here. Potentially not happening. Instead, we're improving the chance to hit. Hundred and eighty damage and that guy has like what three thirty. <laughs> this is thirty damage, uh, not enough to one shot them. That's good, that's good. Like it. I'm listening. 85% chance. Ah no, that's too low. There's a chance for a one shot. Quite. Okay, fantastic. That is a reload. Thanks to Fast Fingers. You are me, asshole. And hopefully this is a kill. Got to drop that last grub. Nice. Good. Some extra defense Keep just up, in Jack. case that thing decides to run into our direction. Advancing. Hate to stand in the open, but I think against the Rancor, it really doesn't make much difference. Curious to see what happens. They are coming out and the grid rocket just directly smashes them, or how is it going to play out? <laughs> okay, that's exactly how it's going to play out. And we're facing three rockets, okay. Plus a fourth one here? No. Ready. First yeah. things first. We gotta deal with that hole. Okay. Wrong frag. There we go. One e hole. Hole closed. We eventually can hunker down or move away. I'll I'm keep here. that op uh, option open for now. Awaiting orders.
Good. Moving up. Good assist, Jack. Jake standing there. Here. Taking the damage reduction, but also giving uh, some. Giving out some extra damage and some extra hit. 55% chance to kill him and explode, which would be great. 10% chance, not even going uh, to be worth it. This, however, is. Lovely. Who's next? Good, we can continue hitting the Rancor here. On standby. Good, we could move to here. The problem is still that one melee guy, which actually is quite a problem. Is this here an explosion range or not? I hated that the indicators are not 100% accurate. I don't want to lose anyone just because I accidentally didn't know that they would be in range. We move to here, but that very close to the Rancor. Likely not a good idea. Support on hand. Too far away to hit. We gotta get yep. a bit closer. Just a 16% chance to hit, and that's not good. That would heal 100 hit points, that wouldn't solve our issue. We could overwatch uh, and interrupt, which definitely uh, would be able to solve our issue. Look, if we're going for like this here. On overwatch. Yes. Wow, the ranker is so massive. We're overwatching Stand against that by. thing. All I hate to stand yeah, in the I'm open, right. but all of the other positions are substantially worse. for Sid. How about move to here? There is a higher chance that the overwatch will actually hit. But also try to just get the evasion going. I think I'll do exactly that. They're taking their shot! Get back, get back. 
Wow, how unfortunate. Oh, wait, he killed that guy. Okay, he killed the small one. Oh, that's good. That Ready solved one of our issues. I read you. Moving over. Yep. Moving over. <laughs> and moving over. Reporting. Okay. Gotta get into healing range. Heading out. Moving over here. And let's Ideas. heal up, although it's not a lot. Taking the Rancor is becoming a problem. Just what I need. Check buffs up our heavy. Sweet. And we do have remote reload just in case we need it. I think we will. Heavy. Yeah, we will need remote reload. Okay. Yo. We have a 40% damage reduction. If we were to turn the Rancor around, does it really have as much range as to run here and hit all of us? I don't think so. He felt that one. Second tank destroyed. Plus, it just lost its second tank. Good. We're on the last tank. Things are turning... Turning around. It seems we're going to get the better of it. Mm -hmm. Let's just not cluster up. remote reload so that all of our damage dealers are back in business again copy and just in ah, well there's no hole that is currently being dug so I might as well reload ready for more brace for assholes I think he now has four rockets. Get back! Ooh, wow. Stay sharp! Brumax upping the blast zone! <laughs> oh wow, okay, well. I was wondering how much he would continue to escalate. Well, the answer is a lot. Moving up. Hitting ourselves with a nice little sniper aura. At this point, I don't mind standing in the open.
I'm listening. Let's start with our sniper. Two extra turns. This is nice it. hit. Give that I like it. All you got. Affirmative. I will give over the extra action to Sid because Sid always Not needs to soldier. turn the Rancor around and he's the only one on the other side thanks to our immaculate positioning here. Good, he's turned around yet again. Yep. Heavy begins to take a shot. them up a bit earlier every little bit of damage counts there we go come on hell yeah That was a clean kill. Oh, wow. So the game developers on, uh, on the boss fights, that Rancor was awesome. I just saw Ukon get his head blown off. And stand right back up. What else aren't you telling me? Your orders are to kill him, not write his biography. The cop put me here before. We're... We're keeping secrets got good people killed. And some secrets also keep people alive. Now do your job. So, you're all wondering why we pulled away from the fight, hmm? Frankly, we're not ready for it. That Brumach was just the start. Our enemies got a whole grub zoo. Shit, no one's even seen yet. And right now, all we have is grit. Which is why your on-the-job training starts today. Look, I don't like it any more than you do. But if there's one thing that the cog is good at, it's making soldiers. You know that. So we learn what we need, and then we kick Ukon's ass back underground. I'll be overseeing a group today. Major Redburn will take you through your paces later. Lucky me. Now, let's go squash some grubs. Hell yeah, let's go squash some grubs. Fantastic, and Diaz even got a promotion. Well, that was an incredibly fun mission. Equipment cases, let's open them all. Double barrel and an Overwatch stock. I have no idea what that is, but we're going to find out in a second. And we found a legendary weapon, so... Or a legendary stock, rather. Light build. What does that do? When this unit moves, it gets 10% accuracy for the turn. Ooh. That's actually quite good. And plus one meter movement range. Since he does not have a really good option to move, I think... That'll be really well um, equipped on him. Alternatively on the scout, of course, but that's fine. Hair trigger. I like it. We got damage. This gives us a 10% chance for an additional shot. 
weapon deals 230 damage so 10 percent is 23 damage which is higher than the 15 damage might as well take that he's not really the kind of like damage dealer but overall definitely doing a good job so far we can now get empower three which i which i would want to have that will give us two actions thank you and up here we do have a reload and 50 percent damage lock and load each unit reloads so that'll be a flat out 50 percent buff of damage that's super strong 50 percent like for one turn everything deals one and a half times uh, as much damage and where is that teamwork oh, okay yeah that teamwork could now give us three actions not sure if i like it as much uh, so far it's good it's not bad but you you will need to have a unit that definitely kills everything so not a hundred percent sure yet And when he kills someone with a chainsaw, it's essentially double heal. Yeah, I suppose that's fine. Next up, we're going for search though, because that uh, ability reset is just too strong. So that's two more levels and then we got search. And search plus lock and load, I think will be a pretty brutal combination crit damage yes i think that's fine we haven't really gotten anything else helmet um everything else is in use no that's the sniper's helm helmet that's the scout's helmet. Damn it, we're missing one helmet. Okay, but it seems we uh, do have everything nicely cleaned. And not surprisingly, after the Rancor, it's now act number two, which is a nice uh, mm, uh, way of potentially ending uh, this episode as well. It's a good cliffhanger. We do have optional objectives and uh, taking stock as the next uh, mission. Overall, I would say our troops have turned out to be uh, working well. I'm still not sure what I would think about all of the classes. Last time the Vanguard uh, with the boss uh, has definitely pulled his weight. I really like uh, the ability to tank. Uh, so that makes an awful lot of sense specifically also with the snipers it seems that the vanguard is the only class that can really like withstand the snipers maybe with the exception of the scout who simply turns invisible and hence can then go and kill the snipers uh, in a different uh, fa uh, in a different way but yeah i would say heavy very very good class for what it's supposed to do keeping enemies away the sniper seems to be the highest single DPS class, although I, it was noticeable that the heavy again um, against the, the boss was dealing quite a bit of damage. So I'm not 100% sure which of the two I like better. If it wouldn't be for that tanking ability, I would potentially say that uh, substituting a scout for Sid here would be a, an, a, a decent setup. But since I wanted to play with storyline characters mainly, we're going to see, unless they hit maximum level, but we're going to see uh, Gabe, Sid, and um, Mikalia, which means it's either a scout to round up uh, that group or a heavy, just to get kind of all of uh, those classes in. And it seems the heavy uh, is better on defensive missions and the scout is better on aggressive missions. Granted, I am not sure how well the scout would have done with a Rancor last turn. Potentially would have needed to use its cloak quite a few times. Anyways, 
this is it uh, for me from uh, today thank you so much for watching guys and enjoy the rest of your day if you like the content leave a comment and a like down below and see you in the next episode bye bye